Welcome back, everybody, to Corn Belt. Here on Farming Simulator 17, woohoo! Your host, well, not the most, maybe. Mr. Boo, aka Tommy Miller, folks, we are starting our sunflower harvest. I believe this is part three, I believe, of the harvest. I uh, got sunflower, this field here to go, and then we got boohoos of soybeans to go. So, uh, yeah. I kind of get, oh, already had that in running. I kind of got the combines backwards here. Um, but yeah, this is all. That header looks small. And where that was. Look how wide that looks and look how small. This is just where it said. Anyway. Uh, we got Donna and now it looks like Mr. Yankee going. Uh, gonna be a total of four workers on the combines. We're all just gonna go in the same direction. And, uh, we're gonna keep them filled that way. Alright, there goes that. Oop, back this other way. Get him started. And, uh, try to keep a space in between them. And that way it won't be no interruptions. Now this is going to be like the episode this morning where I do a bunch of cut screens. So uh hope y'all don't mind that. But yeah, we uh I left the headers over next to Phil uh uh 1548 there at the junction. Um, so all we have to do is drop these off, get the others, and, uh, return these. Because I did buy them, so we can get our money back. So, yeah. Alright, and for our fourth one. Uh, we're a quarter way. Not bad. And get the big boy going. I'm probably going to leave the little one there and take him around on that side for them catch. I'm going to go down here this far end. But look at the width we are making, folks, with four machines. And those are 12.0 uh, meter headers. And we don't have very much time left either. Uh, let me, uh, Put the display up there. As you can see, it's rain every day. So I'm not going to empty him till he gets down to the end. Matter of fact, I'm going to back that off about 20. And uh, go ahead and get our first truck pulled up. Now, these here, all I'm going to do is. Uh, Drive them across the railroad track right there, and then uh, have them go to uh, the nearest waypoint on the uh, last course. We had 48, 49, 50 off roads. Uh, just going to have them drive that course once we get across the track. So, pretty much it on the truck. As you can see, I got all the trucks up here. We got a total of one, two, three, four, five, six trailer trucks. Which we probably don't need that many, but I figure I'll bring all of them just in case, you know. Just that just in case moment. Alright, see so where we're at. We're almost there, so I'm gonna go ahead and start. Man, our case is only at 40%. Wow. So he'll be able to make it all the way back around to the other uh, grab the 
Auger wagon. I sure said gravy wagon. Hey. But um, yeah, um, don't really have. Oh, I thought they were dumping the go. That's okay. Hey, just let me know I was looking at the right one up there. Uh, top left corner, folks, if y'all can see that. Uh, I don't know why it's showing block. Am I blocking it? Not possibly blocked. No, he ain't blocked. Right, I'm just going to back up here. That was only uh, about around 7,000, so yeah, there's. Wasn't that full. I'm gonna go ahead and get this guy. That way, uh, it'll give it spacings back, right? Don't know how this is actually gonna work. So I'm going to kind of watch them while I'm getting that and unloaded. I think what I'm going to do is a circle and go. Instead of them backing up and turning everything, I'm just going to go down about right here. Oh, ran over those. It was on the header instead of on the combine. Uh oh, no, 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 no. Don't do this to me already. There we go. There you go. Well, folks, I'll be right back. I'm going to do a few things and answer this call. Be right back. It really ain't going to take very long to do this field, folks. Whoa, drifting. Um, as you can see, we're almost done. We're basically on top of each other. It's so crowded. Uh, I think I got all the trucks on follow me that we want to roll out. They'll all be in uh, on one group. But, uh, pretty much filling our, well, I already put about 10 or 20,000 liters in this truck. Um, we got 70, so it's almost full. Don't know if I'll fill it or not. Well, it should come close. No, I don't think it did. Oh, yeah. 100,000. All right. Now, I don't know if... I don't think I got it on follow me with the, the first two, but I know that white one's following up the other one, so I'm just going to park this in here. That way I'll know it's full. And I do have some left in here, but it'll be alright. Go catch another combine. See, I think I just caught these two, but I'm going to catch them again. And, um, yeah, that's uh, pretty much all I've been doing is catching combines. Um, every once in a while I'll catch like that and on that end there bring them down to here see he's a uh, half half now, which one was turning on the end ah this one okay. and just keep him from uh wasting all that time I usually just bring them down here and I'll go ahead and empty them. I bet that grain trailer is going to be an auger wagon is going to be in the way. It's amazing it's not. Whoop, whoop. There we go. I'll unload while I'm waiting on him to move out of the way. Let's work that way. Well, folks, I will be right back when we're done. Uh, next up will be beans. I think we'll have to skip to the next day for beans. I don't think they're quite ready yet. But other than that, uh, I'll be back in a minute. 
All right, we are finishing up the last of the sunflowers. Oh, he wouldn't miss. I ain't miss is too wide. And uh, there's Mr. Yankee that uh, Mr. Yankee driving this one. And uh, he's finishing up the last bit of the sunflowers. We're gonna go ahead and turn around. Uh, I do have a couple of the combines over uh, by the soybean down by 50 there. You see where the cursor is at. Um, got the headers changed on them. I have not checked to see if uh, the soybeans will uh, harvest yet or not. Uh, just trying to finish this out. Um, I don't. I, I'm thinking I'm gonna add more to this episode, folks. I haven't counted up my minutes. Let's see how far I'm in. So uh, I'm gonna get all the sunflowers gathered up, which I think uh, I've got. It might be a, a truck and a quarter of, or it might be two truckloads. This bin right here is pretty, pretty loaded. Whoa, got some right here. Probably was a strip all the way down through there, but you just can't see it. All right. As you can see there, we got quite a bit in that. And here's the other two combines I got down here. Got the, the bean headers back on them. And we got 2,600 liters in this one. I had to make a D-line unload, and I thought, no, no, it wasn't a D-line. It was the uh, combine when I pulled them out. That's the only amount he had in them. So as you can see right here, one truck's loaded. And fixing to start on a second one. And that should do it right there. What not even uh, there's a bleh, and that was it. Alrighty, I'm gonna put this in front of the truck here. And we're all gonna go over to the other field all at once. Alright, sixty-six thousand one hundred and twenty-two. Yep. And that combine there is empty. We'll just get behind it. And folks, I'm going to uh, get all of these over to the bean field and get the headers switched over. And whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, that's pretty close. So you go ahead and control F while I'm there. Back off about 25. And uh, get this guy unloaded. So I can put him in between here. And then uh, I will be back when uh, we're ready to get the beans, okay? Uh, well, let's get a, a total before we go. I don't know where I'm going to send these trucks to. Uh, I don't have no course play routes for any of them other than to the farm. And while we're tallying up here, uh, Sunflowers. Maplefield Mill looks the highest. So again, we may just take these <laughs> and, and put them on a train, send them off. So uh, yeah, when I come back, we'll be ready to start the. Uh, well, I don't know. We might haul these off first, uh, but I'll be right back, folks. I'm gonna. Well, let's get the total. I want to say we're gonna get the total, didn't I? All right, get this in the spot. Let me get it right here, right now. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, I'll quit saying. All right, throw L back off to 25, and I doubt if we can do it from here. Control F, yeah, back off to 25. First truck's 100,000. Second truck, 68,800 folks, so 
doing pretty good. Alright, like I said, I'm going to get these two trucks run to the, the farm so we can put it on the train. And I'm going to get everybody else ready and I will be back in just a second. Alright everybody, we have our sunflowers up here, 168,800 liters, and we are now selling, and that was going for the 1530, um, is that it, uh, yeah, that's empty. I mean, we went to the next one. 137,000 for that. Wow. 137,000. 710 liters. Um, come on, auto save. Trying to sell here. Yeah, there you go. You can see it better right there. And that's all she wrote. 106,590. Woo! Wee! Alright, I don't know if, uh, I'm pretty sure the beans are going to be going to Maplefield Mill. I'm not for sure. But I'm going to get this train back and fast forward the time until tomorrow or whenever the beans are ready. And I'll be right back, folks. Another jump. I figure we'll go ahead and get started on the beans on this episode. And then maybe... Um, go across the ones uptown get 50 in the two small fields and then uh do the other ones on uh, the next episode which will probably be wednesday and the oregon springs fans i am sorry that i took up sunday for uh corn belt but uh i'm trying to get this done before june sets in because june's gonna have a little bit different plans so yeah but anyway, I will be back in just a second, folks. All right, folks, I want to show y'all something real quick. We are able to harvest soybeans now. But look how many days I had to go in. That's unreal. You know, it's, what, six days? No, three days in from when I actually post a harvest. So it gives me three days to, to harvest unless I can go past that a little bit. Which I, I don't know, folks. Um, but yeah, it's unreal. So we are going to go ahead and get started. Make sure this is field uh, 50, by the way. It's not too big. But look at the, the forecast, folks. Got rain coming up. It's 8 o'clock in the morning. Okay. I got rain that's coming up. Then I get a day break, and then I got one, two, three, four days of snow. So, if I don't get something done real quick, I can't pull up because I'm on the edge right here. There he goes. I don't want to get these guys too close together, but I want to make sure they're going. We're going to have to hustle. Gonna have to hustle. And this guy here, he's gonna be going up and down, uh, getting this ledge here knocked out because they have a hard time turning around. But, um, probably we'll get him after he does like maybe two rounds on this end. We'll let him, well, when these get back around to here. I'm going to have this in the end behind, and when he gets to the end down there, I'm going to jump over and take out those two small fields. Hopefully. That's the game plan. But, um, oh, we forgot to skip right there, didn't we? Huh. Let's make sure that he's going right. He should. It'll just be this arrow right here, what gets it sometimes. Yep, something I got to change it. I got him going up and down. I still don't know. Oh, it's headlands. Okay. Headlands are off. Alright, um, let me get this buggy on to the three. And then we'll get the... I don't think we'll need a blue uh, buggy on the red combine just yet, but we'll pull it over. 
so I won't feel lonely sitting over. Um, I hope y'all enjoyed it like this, you know, this way you kind of get to see everything. But I know it's in bits and pieces. I don't have time to do the whole thing, you know, because it took right at six hours to harvest that whole field right there. And, uh, yeah, imagine, I'll just do it this way, get back in, teleport over here. We got, uh, four of our trucks down here on this end, which I probably made a boo-boo on that, and we got two trucks down on that end. And like I said, I'm just going to park this in, right here, about right there. And there's our other two trucks there. Got them on that course play. But you can see right there at the top of the map or top of the screen. You got a field there and a field way back there if y'all can see it. Don't know how good these beans are going to turn out. But uh, they like going to be pretty good. Um, at least they're running six mile an hour about normal speed. Our sunflowers are going like crazy through those machines. But yeah, this will give us uh, some turnaround room. And uh, no, I ain't done an inside view of this combine lately, but it's a pretty nice combine. I like the view. Well, I just hope we can beat that rain, folks. I, I really do. Let's go back to our first combine here. And I got the train back to the farm just in case we need to do that. Uh, right now, soybeans. Look, like it's going to be at this place. Uh, no. 42 right here Mary's farm is the highest but this place is going up um, I just wish we get a great demand for them that would be awesome but Mary's farms right around the corner I don't have a course play route for you though but uh well it looks we just go across take that road there and cross the bridge and we'll be at Mary's farm uh, uh, this south of Bill 8 there. Alright, um. Hello. Hmm. I'm thinking. I might just take one of these. No, we'll, we'll, we'll take Red because he moves faster. Uh, what are you doing? Uh, who we got here anyway? Uh, Heifer Jason. Okay. Then we got uh, Junior, Birch Video 573, and Max Ann on the, the equipment here. Who's driving that? Well, yeah, we gotta keep an eye on Jason uh, when he gets down to that end. We change direction. I think I'm gonna go ahead and empty empty him out up here and uh, see what we got. Still thinking about taking two of these and go ahead and go back around, get those back fields knocked out of the way. Probably take the the last one here and and uh, Jason's. Um, I was right there at it. Yeah, he's getting there.
not too bad. Get back in the tractor here. But I'm going to miss this map in a way, and well, I'm not. Um, good, he, he's waiting. I got time to get over here and get the pipe out. Oh, come on now. Don't, 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 don't. Yeah, there you go. Hold up right there. There you go. Perfect. But uh, what I'll probably do is do a lot of this off screen and uh, get everything moved down south because our next spill is going to be uh, right here. So we'll get this in and top of 52, west of 53 here, and this block right here. And then uh, we'll be good to go. So, um, I got about maybe, whoa, don't hit him. For about three or four more minutes on this episode, folks, if I counted right. And, uh, so we're fixing, uh, let this combine go down to that end. And then we're going to jump over. Uh, oh. Perfect time and perfect. Oh, went too far. <clears throat> All right, I think uh, it just switched the header on me. I can switch it back. That's a good little turnaround room there. Uh, no, 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 no. There you go. And I'm going to get this buggy. Following him now. Case Magnum 380. All right, that work. And I'm gonna go ahead and empty this into one of these trucks. Probably, preferably the front one. Oh, I got a little spotlight on the auger. I've never noticed that before. Well, that's awesome. That's realistic there. Which some of the older ones don't have and the newer ones do. Uh, go ahead and unload. Oh, that thing unloads fast. But look how big that auger is. That's like a 24-inch auger pipe in real life. All right, let's get on this last one here. Know how to worry about Jason for a while. I, I guess that's still Jason down there. Uh, can't really tell. Too many names down there now. All right, there we go. Control F. Oh yeah, that's the pill we're going to get. And then one pass it. I think we'll go ahead and cut our way down and around and then work our way back up this way with two and the other two get this we'll take the big auger wagon back here that holds more so really I need to bring this one up Go ahead and unload him. Oh, oh, I forgot. It stops now. Used him going on the go. Oh, he was pretty loaded, wasn't he? Okay, yep, this is the last one. We're going to let those two there just keep on going around. And uh, we're going to get this one over here. 
And folks, I hate to say it, but I'm just about out of time. So I'm going to do these two fields here off screen. Uh, there's not much to it. I'll see them before when I was planting. And uh, like I said, when we come back next episode, we'll probably be down south. I have those two in this field here finished. So, um, so I hope y'all enjoyed it. Uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button if you're new. And if you're an old uh, family member, make sure you hit the like button. And most of all, for all of y'all, make sure you share me with your friends. I'm trying to get to that 1,000. I know I already got to the, I got to the 500 probably about, what, 10 times, I believe. So I'm just about there again, but I'm shooting for 1,000. So uh, y'all be sure and share me. And folks, I will see y'all next episode. So y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and I will see you later.